What's up? Hi, how are we doing? Did you get a call or something? Uh, we did get a call uh, oh. from the neighboring property. Oh, so it's not the actual like owner of this property then. No, I mean, we've had some issues with people camping, so that's oh. the reason why. Yeah, you got to uh, camp it across the street. Yeah, I camp across the street, but people are like not camping at the designated campsites. We've had yeah, I'm not. That. I'm just saying, and I was here for this place, so I plan on being here for the day. So okay. I, I just want to hang out and uh, relax here for the day, pretty much. Okay, gotcha. Uh, All right, I just wanted to. Uh, you've got people see me here, and it's yeah. You, okay, but I mean, besides camping, uh, has there been any like crimes? I mean, cause this is pr this is private property, I believe, right? Right. Yeah. yeah. If they do complain and they want you gone off the property, then. Uh, yeah, and it's advertised. Whoever owns it, there's a sign. You call the number, and you can find out. Or you could, I'm sure you, your computer shows you uh, um, who owns the property. But I know I can look at an uh, app called Regrid, okay. and it uh, says <laughs> says who the owners are. I never checked, but uh, I mean, I assume it's since it's developed. And it does say it's kind of a a public road, but I, I get the. Uh, I'm not sure how far the public road would extend from that intersection of the stoplight. Okay. It's just, I don't know what the name of it was like. So it's Oak Street. The name of the street that comes back here. Uh, there's like a Oak Street. And, and, you, and I, I saw your car over there kind of looking at me. You're, you're probably looking for a way to get back here from that side. But it's got to drive around. And, like We've had some it's people camping out back here. Yeah, past, it's, so not, it's not. That's the reason why it's just double checking. And so no. I'm just gonna let you know that uh, within city limits there is no camping unless it's designated camping spots, okay. like yeah. in the campground. Yeah. So no, I'm just letting no, you know. Don't pitch a tent or start a campfire. Yeah. yeah don't it's, be doing anything like that. So yeah. how's, again, you're probably passing through. So how's, how's the homeless population here? Uh, we have had an increase in uh, some homeless population and stuff like that. So okay. A lot of people just passing through. Okay, um, all right. So, what's is that something smoking in your, your car? Yeah, yeah, it's it's oh. uh, just a warming up uh, uh, something. Okay. And I got two two minutes. Okay. Yeah, it's perfectly, I've been doing it for years. Warming up some stuff. Oh, food. warming up food and stuff. Yeah. Oh, I mean, okay. No, I just saw it's, something smoking, and I'm yeah. like, oh, hey, that's that's not normal. It's not, so. it's not, uh, it's not a, uh, uh, it's, it's just propane. Okay. So, I mean, it's like lighting a cigarette in, in a way with that big fire. It's, it's, you know, it's, it's no, uh. That doesn't sound too safe for being in a car. Well, I've been, I've been doing it for years. I mean, okay. It's just, uh, it's just a quick warm-up. I mean, I have a couple minutes, yeah, that's what you're seeing, so, I mean. I mean, I just need to give it a little bit more time. Gotcha. All right, I, we haven't had any complaints or anything, man. I just wanted to, you know, just... Hearts, hearts of USA? Okay. Yes. Yeah, I mean, I got a timer here, so I mean, that's, that's what I've been watching over while I've been out here exercising with my sticks. Yeah, I, don't I know. saw you doing some... I, uh, I, I wonder at what parts, at what point they decided they needed to call me. Probably not the stick exercises I was doing. We've had some it's, people in the woods over the, over there, and so okay, the got, owner actually, I just talked talk to the owner, and got, uh, she's uh, voicing complaints. Oh, the the actual landlord you may have talked oh, to. Oh, there's a there's a rental property okay. just uh just west of over here. Okay. See where all those buildings are, to the to the left, right behind those trees over there. Yeah, there's there's, there's a, a bunch of buildings over stuff. Okay. That, all right. Uh, the property owner over there, or the manager, she's all right. had some issues uh, with uh, homeless population. So. <sighs> All right, I'm stopping it. All right, man, I'll let you yeah, get back I, to I know this. They want to develop this into housing along the river. That seems to be the primary interest. There's supposed so. to be a Myers coming up here sometime soon. That was... I'm not, is that a grocery store? Yeah, kind of like uh, Walmart. Kind of like Walmart, but it's... I know there's a Fred Myers on the west side of the country, mm -hmm. but a Myers, yeah, I'm not too familiar with. Yeah, it's kind of like That's... a catch-all type of thing, grocery... Okay. You know, yeah. Type of stuff. Yeah. I, yeah, I looked at Google Maps. That's how I kind of saw this. Yeah. I, I was in the Walmart parking lot using the Wi Fi gotcha. and I, I saw this development and walked over here and it looked fine. Okay. Looked like they pretty much are just kind of set. It doesn't sound like they really have people. You said a Myers. Mm -hmm. they, the, the talks are, are developing. Gotcha. But yeah, they're, they're prepared, but I don't see. There's no equipment at all. all right. Just uh, electrical and. 
That's about all. I, and fire hydrants, I'm staying. I'm not parked next to the fire. They're, only, they're probably not even operation anyway. But um, yeah, and then that road that's that's a dirt road that goes in. It's really it's amazing how much trash there is on the sides of the roads around here. I mean, that's that's what's to be expected in these types of uh, uh, around rural areas, around the uh, shopping districts and stuff. So yeah, I mean, I I don't. I, I would like to be here, you know, till about the evening time and okay. and um, take off. All right, um, sir. So I mean, I, they're in Effingham. <laughs> you know what I think, Effy? I'm new here, so I'm, I'm thinking of swear words whenever I hear the oh, the name. Yeah. It's like, wow. Yeah. You know? And a ham, it's like maybe there's a you know a police coordination there. And also, let me just say, um, I'm kind of here for the solar eclipse this yep. but i think i want to go just a little further south for that uh, the, i think the, the total totality uh whatever it's called uh it's cup, yeah the total darkness area whatever it is it's supposed to be hitting uh around carbon yeah well it's, it's yeah. i know it's coming from texas all right, the way to yeah. maine yeah. well and, and the line we're we're just like just north or just on the line mm -hmm. i just study i looked at it I a little bit i think it kind of varies from day to day with whatever uh Data, people are Ever. Doing. So, yeah, sometimes wobbles. it's like they're saying hey, it's a further north, sometimes further south, like by a yeah. few miles or whatever. But like, yeah, I think it's further south. I might want to go back to Newton. I was in Newton. That's a nice, quiet town. Yeah. Might fall back there for the eighth at two o five. Okay. It's when for four minutes. For four minutes. Yeah. I see you got a lot of cameras. Hopefully, you can get some pretty good shots. Yeah, so. I think I'd like to just you know play around with it. I really don't have any great ideas yeah. about how to make it fun or whatever just, gotcha. yeah just, just uh, be safe I, I think we're supposed yeah. to be getting a uh, quite a bit of people coming into town yeah because we're in that zone yeah you, um just be careful because yeah, uh because we're, we're gonna get a huge influx of people. Uh, okay yeah, yeah with traffic I mean, and stuff just, just, just to get the the most out of this full eclipse because yeah. who wants a partial eclipse exactly. you want to be yeah. and it's a lining of sight issue so yeah, to to get in, don't stare at the, don't stare at it or whatever. But yeah, you're in a, you know, almost a once in a lifetime thing. Even though it kind of happened in 2017, gotcha. I was in San Francisco at the time. I didn't notice it. Where where were you around here in 2017? I was in California. Okay, so yeah, you were out of the path. Yeah, maybe we, we didn't have the total eclipse, but uh, yeah. I did actually get to see. Yeah, the, just some a little other, darkness. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't notice anything in San Francisco mm -hmm. when I was there, but there was a, they let the school out and they just sat in like the stadiums and yep. just kind of watched the sky. At the library, they had a TV on and they'd show just a camera pointed at the sun, mm -hmm. showing how that. But I, I looking outside, I didn't notice. So this this is an opportunity for me to okay. see this eclipse in its full um, presentation. Right. So, yeah, and for everybody, for you guys too. Maybe, maybe you guys could let the people, the guys out of jail, just so they could see it a little bit, right? <laughs> yeah. So that yeah. might be, you know, this is a once in a lifetime thing. Uh, I think know, it's, uh, it happens it, a couple times, but, so often, but. Uh, yeah. Well, uh, it's, it's, yeah, a dog's life, once yeah. in a dog's life. So. All, all right, right, sir. Well, I'll let you get back to it. I don't want okay. to give up any more of your time. Yeah. Just, uh, just have you safe. I just, I'm right, just letting you know if there's any future calls, I'll. I, I, I want to just be here till the evening okay. and then I'm leaving. You won't see me here. Well, if I ask your name, that at, way in case well, we do get future calls. Yeah, it's Travis. Travis. I can say that. What's your first Matt. M. Matt yep. Simpson. Okay. All right, sir. All right, Travis. Okay. Take care. All right, man. All right. Sounds good. Yep. Mm-hmm. <clears throat>